everybody. My name is Dr. Tanya Adi from the University of Sydney and Invertebrates Australia. Today we're going to be talking about the life cycle and ecology of Christmas beetles. Christmas beetles start their lives as little eggs that are laid into the soil during the summertime. These eggs eventually hatch into larvae, often called curl grubs. Curl grubs are big, chunky larvae. They're usually a creamy or white color, and they tend to have a very distinct orange to brown head. These little beauties will live in the soil between, for between a year and two years. We're not 100% sure what the larvae eat while they're in the soil, but it's very likely things like decaying organic matter, um, rotting wood, and potentially the roots of some native plants. So they've spent a year to two years getting bigger and stronger, those curl grubs will create a pupa. It's a bit like a cocoon that we think of when we think of things like butterflies and moths. Inside that pupa, a remarkable transformation takes place. The larvae's body breaks down into a kind of larva soup, and that soup reforms in the pupa into that lovely adult Christmas beetle. Adult Christmas beetles feed on the leaves of gum trees. In some cases, there can be so many Christmas beetles on a tree that it loses all of its leaves. Now, this may sound like a bad thing, but it's important to remember that um, trees being eaten, that's part of ecology, that's part of nature, and it's part of the normal process of a forest that helps to keep renewing forests. So yes, seeing lots of Christmas beetles on a tree, a beloved tree can be sad, but it's really important. And in most cases, Christmas beetles don't get up to those types of numbers to cause large scale problems. Christmas beetles are super important for a whole bunch of our native wildlife. Because they emerge from the soil at a predictable time every year, just in the springtime when many other animals are raising their young, because of that, they're a super important food source for things like birds and mammals. Think of them as delicious flying balls of protein. <laughs> it's not great for the Christmas beetle, but it's an important part of supporting our native ecosystems. In the soil, the larvae, because they're quite large, they're busy burrowing around the soil, helping to keep the soils healthy by moving it around and by helping to break down organic matter, and, uh, thus keeping our soils nice and healthy. So Christmas beetles do a lot of important roles uh, in the Australian ecosystem, and it's so important that we help to protect them. All right, that's it. Thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you next time.